Assalamu alaikum. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to merge two videos using VLC Media Player. First of all, I have these two videos in this folder. So I have these two videos as video 1 and video 2. Those two files are in MKV format. So first of all, I need to convert these two files into the same format called MP4. So for that reason, I am opening my VLC Media Player. Then from the VLC Media Player's media menu, I have to select these two files by clicking this open multiple files option. So I click open multiple files. Then I select this add button over here. So I click this add button and select these two files wherever the location is. So I'm at the same location as these two videos are. Or if you are not in this folder, just go to the location those uh, videos are kept. So I go to this captures folder and I have these two videos. So I select these two videos and I click open. So now the VLC media player will show these two videos in this open media option. So here we have to be careful about selecting this convert option. So we select this convert option over here and we have to select a conversion profile. So it is better to use this H.265 option over here because it will take a lesser amount of space but it will be harder for your processor. So let's select this one and in the destination file you do not need to select anything and just click on this append converted to file name so by selecting this option it will create two more files that will have one uh, that will have this uh, hyphen converted appended to the file name so i click to this one and it will take some time for these two files into new uh, two new files so you see that first of all i have this uh, video 2 converted dot mp4 so this video 2 is being converted to mp4 and after this conversion is finished i will have these two over here so i'll pause the video for this conversion to be finished so it will take some time to finish the conversion depending on the size of the video so We see the conversion is all over. So if you want to see the video, the conversion So the conversion is almost over. The conversion will be over. It will show nothing. I will just close the window of VLC. Now we have these two new files, video one, one, video two, and they have this converted to append it to their file names. So now we are interested in these two files only. So video 1 converted mp4 and video 2 converted mp4. So now <clears throat> we will use some special commands to convert these two files into one single file. So for that reason we have to specify some command. So in order to specify the command we need to issue the command line. So I click on the address bar over here. So let me show you. I click on this address bar over here. So I just type cmd and I press enter. cmd stands for command. So it will create, it will open the command line window over here. In here, we have to type some special command or special code that I will put you, I will put it in the description. So what this command actually does, it is telling VLC that you take this file and you take that file and output in the, in this file name and keep the source files as well. So I will copy this command over there and I click on this uh, command prompt and I just simply right click on it. So this command will be tested. Now we have to specify the path where this vlc.exe is located. So it is quite common to install any software in the program files folder. So I have this program files folder and I have it, uh, this VLC uh, is over here, video LAN. Then I have this VLC.exe, that means our uh, VLC, it's over here. Or you can just simply uh, go to the properties and see the location or where this VLC file is located. So I just copy this line over here, from here. So I go back to the command prompt then i right click once again so and i put 
a backslash in order to make the path clearly and also due to windows system you need to put a double quotation mark before this uh before specifying this whole thing so the full address of vlc should be this c drive program files video lm or wherever the vlc uh, media player is installed over here now we have to mention the two source files so our two source files was named at our two source files were uh, named as video one converted and video two converted so video one converted and video two converted these two files needs to be mentioned over there so i go back over here and i will mention these two files so i type uh, video or simply copy this name video one converted and video two converted so i go there i cut this i right click to paste this so video one converted dot mp4 and i'll do the same thing for the second file as well so i right click on here here and it will say that video converted and this is two so i have these two files mentioned over here those two files we have converted earlier so video this name uh the name of these two files needs to be exactly the same the converted files so afterwards the destination file will be of this name so i do not have anything else so i just press enter and wait so vlc will open it will do some stuff and we will check if it has any final file name over here we see that the new file has already been created just give it some time to populate the file so let us refresh and i think uh, the file is working now so after everything is done it will take some time so just give it some time and just i close this vlc so now this is the new file i just double click on it and so so we see that the length of the file is 5 minutes and 25 seconds which was actually the length of these two files so video 1 and video 2 these two were 1 minute and 2 minutes so these two files were merged uh, I mean, so these two files were merged and we see that these two files are merged into one file which is called the final file name so this is how you should uh, you can use vlc to convert any file or to merge two or three or many multiple files into one single file so thank you very much for watching i'll put the code in the description as well thank you very much assalamu alaikum